Diodes makes products for the logic and semiconductor markets, products used in everything from flat panel TV screens to mobile phones to medical devices. I'm joined from the NASDAQ market site by the company's CEO, Dr. Kei Shu Lu. Thank you so much for your time. Well, thank you, uh, Randa, and good morning. We know that after your last earnings report, investors did sell some of your stock. There were concerns about a drop in revenue from the Asian market, your key market. How do things look in the second quarter in terms of demand from Asia? Well, the demand from Asia in the second quarter is still uh, quite weak. It's not as strong as we expected. But uh, we believe the second half of this year, the market should be uh, go back to the growth mode and should be stronger than first half. Tell me a little bit as well about your business in Europe. Any problems due to what we're seeing with the weakness in the euro? Uh, in the euro, it's because the, the exchange rate is the one cause of the problem. But the, from dial point of view, we actually grew you know, 14% uh, you know, quarter over quarter in one queue. So the problem came in from exchange rate, but not in the dial growth uh, strategies. And if you look at the second quarter, I think the exchange rate is stabilized. Therefore, you know, from the growth point of view, we should be okay. So your products, as I mentioned early on, are used in a lot of different industries. Which end market are you seeing the strongest demand this year? Is it consumer electronics or automotives or industrial or something else? Well, if you are talking about in the, in the Asia, then <coughs> our product, you know, is uh, we participate in the cell phone, but even the overall cell phone is the market stabilized, but the high-end smartphone actually still continue growth and taking the share from the traditional low-end phone. And since Dio was is participate in the smart high-end phone, therefore it's still good for the company. Now, if you look at the global market, then especially in U.S. and Europe the industrial and the automotive is two of the major growth area. Dr. Luwa ended there. Thank you so much for your time today. Thank you. I'm Rhonda Schaffler for The Street.